Well, I personally would like to see every coal plant replaced by a nuclear plant, but if it's me, not me, me too, me too, but that's a that's a tall order. But well, that's get to a that. tall order. And the thing is, I really have come to the conclusion that reliability is absolutely the most important thing. That is the most a reliability and affordability is what makes ordinary people's lives decent. You know, it, it's what means that ordinary people can you know, live in a house that's reasonably warm, uh, that can uh, expect that the, if they, they, they have a, uh, 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 an elderly member of the household who needs a warm room with a little space heater in it, that the room will stay warm because the, the, uh, the space heater will continue to have power. Right. I mean, there's so many things uh, oh, let's let's look at the fact that um, when I was on our town energy committee, uh, water treatment plants take a lot of power, and turning uh, turning the power off to water treatment plants is not a good thing. And I, I guess what I'm trying to say is that reliability is key, and those coal plants are not going to influence global warming so much that keeping them going is a clear and present danger to the future of humans and we're all going to die if we keep them going uh, that's not what is happening i mean to some extent humans like any any reasonable animal wants to live now okay uh, in other words the idea that possibly the coal plants will increase global warming okay but meanwhile, if you turn them off, you'll kill people now. 